Hi everyone, Abby here, and welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to be reviewing the Lululemon Always Effortless Jacket. But before I get started, make sure to hit that subscribe button so you can stay tuned to all my new videos dropping weekly, and so you can help the channel grow. So I have two Always Effortless Jackets to show you guys today. On the left, we have the Porcelain Pink in a size 12. And on the right, we have the Rustic Coral in a size 10. All right, guys, so for my sizing recommendation, I would recommend either staying true to size or going down one, depending on how you want it to fit and your preferences. I just wanted to show you guys two different sizes because I know a lot of people don't know what size to get for the Always Effortless jacket. We have a lot of people saying size down, we have a lot of people saying stay true to size. So I'm gonna show you guys my true to size and one size down, so then you can decide you know, which one to get from there. And now I'm going to show you guys the tag. So some highlights about the Always Effortless jacket is that it is water repellent, it is wind resistant, it has a cinchable waist, it has a stowable hood, it has five different pockets, uh, with two of those being interior. So it's definitely great for a bunch of different conditions, whether you're caught in like wind, light rain, or if you're just trying to throwing it on for some coverage from the sun or anything, it's fantastic for that. And the price on the Always Effortless jacket is $138. All right guys, so I'm gonna show you the logo on both of these jackets up close because they are different. So depending on the jacket you have, you're gonna see little differences. So this one right here is the porcelain pink. On the back, we see a silver logo here, Lululemon's classic logo. See that here. And on the sleeve, there is a beautiful Lululemon printed right here. And I absolutely love that little touch. Now coming over to the rustic coral. The logo spot is right here, but we can see now that the logo on here is a rustic coral color. As you guys know, I like the classic silver logos because they pop more, but that's what you're gonna see on this jacket. And there is no logo on the sleeve for this one. Only some versions of the Always Effortless jacket do have that. I know some people like their logos to stand out, some people like them to be blended in, so you guys might wanna pick a color depending on your preferences there. Now I'm gonna go ahead and try them on so you can see what they look like on me. In the Rustic Coral, once again, this is size 10. So this is me sizing down one because my typical jacket size for Lululemon is a size 12. It's a little bit shorter when you do size down in the length here. All right guys, and here it is in the size 12. This is my typical um, true to size. And as you guys can see, the sleeves are definitely longer. It is a longer length on me. And it's just a little bit more roomy overall. So personally, I think that you can go with either size and you're gonna be happy. I love having my size down and true to size. I can't really pick a favorite on which one I like more, but comment below. What do you guys think? Which size looks better on me, the 10 or the 12? Inside of the jacket here, I did wanna show you that it does have an interior pocket over here, and it also has another interior pocket on this side. So you are able to kind of stick some stuff inside of here if you do want to do that. And there is interior draw cords for the waist. Cinches in the waist, so I'm going to show you guys what that looks like on. So you kind of just pull and then slide it on each side. And now it's cinched. And one awesome thing about the Always Effortless jacket is it has like a secret pocket in here. <laughs> and you can go ahead and stick your whole phone in here, a card, it's a huge capacity pocket guys, it fits my whole hand as you can see. Not a detachable hood, but you are able to convert the hood into a collar just to hide it and get out of the way if you don't want that around you. So you're just gonna kind of fold it. And then you clip it, there's a button here and then you just kind of tuck it in here to hide it. And the hood is gone, it's hidden. So this is what it looks like now without the hood. And I actually like wearing it this way when it's cold because when you tuck the collar into here, it makes it more of a snug fit against your neck. So it helps prevent like wind from getting in there. And just quickly talking about the pockets. The pocket over here does have a little kind of mesh holder that you could stick your phone or other important things in there just to make sure that it doesn't go missing on you. But the pockets do zip up on both sides. Now, just doing a quick zipper demo. I want to show you guys that the zippers on the Always Effortless jacket are phenomenal. No issues here, they zip up smoothly. Nice and smooth. And now the porcelain pink. Equally as smooth, guys. 
can really dress it up or down. It's definitely effortless indeed. The name here is perfect. All right guys, so one thing I love about the Always Effortless jacket is it has a nice big hood. So once you put this on, it covers your entire head. So if you're caught in the rain, you're not gonna get your hair wet or anything. Um, it comes just over my eyes, guys. As you can see on the model, I don't think she's wearing the hood fully. The fabric here is great because it is water and rain resistant. This is perfect for a bunch of different temperatures. You can basically wear this year round, winter, spring, summer, fall, as long as you layer appropriately. All right guys, so considering the price, the quality, the color, the fit, the durability, the functionality, and everything like that, I would go ahead and give the Always Effortless jacket a 9.3 out of 10. And I definitely do give it a thumbs up. And if you guys are interested in buying the Always Effortless jacket, I'm gonna go ahead and leave a link in the description below for other, all the current colors available. And thanks for watching, guys. I hope you did find this review helpful. If you do wanna see me review anything else from Lululemon, drop that in the comments below. Thanks for watching, guys, and make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.